Right, the microalgae to energy project here at NMMU has been going on for about just over three years. Um, and the project contains a number of main components. Uh, the first component is the actual cultivation of the algae, where we, the approach that we follow uh, is using a photobioreactor system consisting of vertical columns. And unlike the normal practice internationally where we look at where they try and cultivate a specific strain, we use a, uh, a colony of algae. Uh, and we, we try and maximize productivity per unit area. The, we use flue gas for the cultivation because the algae needs the CO2 and also the, the NOx that is contained in the flue gas is used by the algae as a, as a nutrient. So if you put this next to a point source of uh, CO2 pollution like a power station, uh, the, the generator can benefit uh, quite significantly by a reduction of both CO2 and NOx emissions. The biomass that we harvest, uh, we can either blend in with coal, which is currently our biggest focus. So we can blend microalgae biomass in with, with waste coal, uh, anywhere between 5 and 20 mass percent, and then use the mixture of algae and coal for different applications. So we can either use it for straight combustion, for power generation, or we can actually convert the coal-algae mixture into a very clean coal, as one of the products and a very nice crude oil as a secondary uh, a product. Uh, for example, in South Africa, if we, if we are able to process all the waste coal that we produce, uh, we can roughly produce 70% of our entire crude oil demand in, in, that, in that particular fashion. The alternative application is that we take the biomass and convert that directly into a, a biofuel what we do is we convert it into a bio crude oil, not a biodiesel, but a bio crude oil. Uh, and in this way, we can recover much more of the energy contained in the biomass than just what is contained in the biodiesel fraction. Uh, currently, the project is sponsored by the government, the Department of Science and Technology. We are in the process of completing the engineering designs for a technical demonstration site. Uh, may be built next year, uh, which will be in the order of a hectare scale, and from there it should be commercialised.